Hey everyone, this is Sam Fan, and welcome back to the 2K Lab channel. Today we're going to talk about the best playmaking badges on 2K23. So in this video, we'll be taking a deep dive into the Needle Further badge and we're going to show you exactly what situations trigger it and what kind of benefits you get per badge level. Now in regards to activation, this patch triggers on tight windows and that one actually did qualify as a needle threader trigger. But if we also slow the clip down, you can actually see the other benefits of needle threader, which is it makes it harder to tip passes and it also acts as a soft counter against interceptor as you can see in that frame right there. It gets through to the tight window and gets an assist. Here you can see once again needle threader kicks in, acts as a soft counter against interceptor, avoids the tip pass and gets right to the corner shooter for a wide open switch ball. And it also has another effect that actually is very quantifiable and is not mentioned in the definition and as you see it play out here, focus on this defender, Needle Fredder can stun defender in passing lanes that are in bad position. So this defender right here is not in good position by 2K's definition and you see he gets stunned by the Needle Fredder which helps the pass get to his spot and that's a very deadly element. So by the numbers in terms of the stun rate percentage for Needle Fredder, here you can see at no batch is about a 3% chance. Bronze is 7%, silver is a 10, gold is 13%, so it's a pretty consistent jump of 3%. Now, getting into Hall of Fame though, you get a bigger jump from 13 to 17, and the other big jump is obviously from none to bronze, where you get a 4% jump. Now, it is also important for us to let you guys know what it doesn't do, and Needle Fighter actually won't help you speed up passes, that's what pass accuracy does, and it also doesn't trigger on full court fast break passes, because that's reserved for break starter. So make sure you keep those things in mind, and in the comment section, make sure you leave us a number between 1 to 10 to let us know how you feel about Needle Fredder and how many of those stun animations actually do you see when you use the badge or do you get stunned by the badge itself when you're playing help defense? So give us a rating and if you use this badge a ton, definitely let us know about your experience on it. We would love to hear it. So as always, thanks for coming by. Make sure to check out the website at nba2kdat.com for hundreds and thousands of more tests and we look forward to speak to you guys again very soon.